What's going on YouTube fam bam? It's your girl Des with Des Crazy Life and I am back with another video. Y'all, so um, today, 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 I'm going to talk to you guys about what's been going on with me my last 30 day hiatus from YouTube. Okay, so about three Mondays ago, I had an appointment with my new cardiologist and he just shot it to me straight he told me that um he thinks that me having an ablation is a very bad idea and he feels like because i'm young that i need to try to um fix the problem or improve my uh svt by adhering to my diet um becoming very active and um you know just avoiding my triggers right which means no soda no stimulants no chocolate no you know all the good stuff that I love to eat you know obviously no cold medicine no alcohol no nothing right so and he told me I had to lose another 30 pounds and so I was like wow okay so he told me he said don't go in just so that you can get a permanent fix and then you start abusing your body eating any and everything right so he told me that i need to take charge of my life not take the cop out route because yes i will be on metoprolol for the rest of my life but it can be um the dose could be uh dropped and um, he said, or, and I could even get to the point where I only need to take it um, when I have an arrhythmia, right? When I have an event. So um, that's what I'm doing. So I got a, at first, I'm not even going to lie, you guys, that first week I was kind of defeated, you know, but um, the last two weeks I've been back working out. So what I'm doing is. Uh, two days a week, I do an hour of cardio, and y'all, Saturday, Saturday, y'all, was the first day I was able to break out in a full-blown run for 15 minutes on the treadmill out of my hour, and um, I've also noticed, you guys, that my heart rate when I first got started um, working out again it was in the 170s but it in in you know up to the high 170s but now when i'm on the treadmill um my heart rate will max will cap out in the 140s now so that's like great you know and then um i'm doing weight training with my personal trainer three days a week and on the days that i train with him um, I only do 20 minutes of cardio when I tell y'all that I don't see a huge drop on the scale but I can see the difference in my face um, I can see the difference in my clothes I'm able to wear a size large um, workout clothes now and um, I was in an extra large and I'm not like busting out of it either. And my trainer told me that if I want to lose weight quicker, that I should wear a um, thermal suit underneath my um, workout gear. And I should always wear like a sweatshirt um, that'll help promote the burn. And I said, okay. And, um, but I'm seeing the results. I feel great. Y'all, I got through the weight training set and he is brutal, y'all. My trainer, he, like when I have to take breaks, he, you know, he understands it. And um, last week I had to take a lot of breaks during my sessions with him. I, I, I mean, out of an hour, I probably only got maybe 40 minutes of actual training because I was taking so many breaks, I had to. The first time I worked out with him, I went into AFib 
um, because I disobeyed him and I did 40 minutes of training cardio before I dealt with him and all I had was a protein shake so my um, it's like I ran out of fuel I ran out of energy like 20 minutes into the weight training and then all of a sudden I broke into AFib y'all and it took about 10 minutes for that arrhythmia to break but it did it broke now since I know what I need to do and um, how I need to prepare like my meal prep and stuff like that pre-workout especially with him um, I haven't had any more arrhythmia since then. I haven't had an SVT attack. I haven't had um, another AFib attack. I haven't had any of that. And um, today, I noticed that when I was on the treadmill for those 20 minutes, and I was, I was giving it, you know, I was really doing it as hard as I could. My heart rate never broke the 130s. It stayed in the 120s. So I can see my endurance is improving and it's increasing. And um, I'm gonna work with him for 90 days, well, really 100 days, I'm gonna work with him. And I'm probably gonna extend that to another 100 days, um, just so that I can get everything down and I can get the circuits down um, and learn how to set up my own weights and stuff like that, you know? Yeah, but it's, I've never did weight training at all, y'all. I've only been on the treadmill my entire life, and it's, it doesn't look that hard. It doesn't look physically demanding, the stuff that he has me doing when he shows me the example of what he wants me to do, but when I have to physically do it, oh yeah, it's, it's, it's rough, and he's taking it easy on me, y'all. He's going easy on me, but I can't tell. <laughs> he says he's going easy on me, but I can't tell, y'all. But, y'all, I am, I'm totally loving life. I feel great. Um, and I just, I just said, you know what? I'm just going to live, you know? I'm going to enjoy myself. I went shopping. Um, I've gone down, um since the last time I shopped, which was forever, I've gone down two dress sizes. So that was a pleasant surprise. I was like, what? You know, so I, you know, it's just, it's just been great. It's been awesome. The Hubbington and I are doing great. You know, he just told me, please don't try to go back to work. Cause, um, you know, I sure was thinking it, <laughs> but he was like, please don't go back to work. He said, just stay at home with the kids, you know, go shopping, go do whatever you want to do, but please just take care of the kids, take care of the house, take care of me, and don't worry about working, please. So, um, I'm going to continue to listen to him and not do those things and get into great shape. Um, my goal is to hit the 160s. I want to be in the um the 160s i broke the 180s um last week but um he my trainer told me that i have to start eating more because i'm not eating enough for weight training he said period um but because i've been eating i was just eating one small meal and um a protein shake every day that's what i was doing and he told me no that's also why i probably had such a hard time last week as well because i wasn't giving my body enough fuel so he said what he wants me to do from now on because today i had three eggs um and half a cup of spinach mixed in together and um, I had that for breakfast with some lemon water. And I did not, I had to break, but it wasn't from, it wasn't like last week. I did my sets, I did the circuit, um, and I did pretty okay. Um, and I didn't feel completely exhausted and I didn't run out of energy. So I was able to complete everything 
So I did an hour and 20 minutes in the gym today. So I'm feeling really good. And the hour of that was weight training. And then um, he told me that I need to just do two small meals a day and drink two protein shakes a day. So on the days that I weight train with him, I have a small uh, low carb breakfast and um like after i train with him three to four hours later i should have a protein shake and then three to four hours after that i should have a meal and then three hours after that the final protein shake and he said that's what i need to do he said later he's gonna up it to three meals a day and two protein shakes so um, I was just like, okay, whatever you tell me to do, I'm going to do it. And so I'm, I'm just, I am so happy. I feel so much better. I feel so empowered. And um, life is good, guys. Life is good. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, so I'm, I'm trying to get this. I'm, I'm trying to get to where, you know, I don't have all this jigga jigga jiggly jiggly you know I'm, I'm trying to get to where i have some guns up here you know some guns i don't have none right now y'all it's just i just got the flap right now just the the fat and the flap but i'm gonna get them guns don't worry i'm gonna get them guns and y'all like another thing that i noticed is my um my cellulite on my legs is starting to dissipate like tremendously and i think it's because of that um thermal that i wear underneath um underneath my uh my workout clothes because like it's seriously dissipated like tremendously so i'm i'm like okay okay so i'm 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 not going to jinx myself and say it'll all be gone by the 100 days being up, but I'm pretty sure it'll be like night and day. It'll be like barely there. Like it'll be some small spots, but not like the whole thigh, 360 the whole thigh, you know, like it is right now. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, I'm just, uh, I'm just so happy. I'm so thankful. I'm grateful to God and um, he'll do it. You know, faith without works really is dead because you just really, really have to want it and you have to do something, right? If you're expecting something, you have to do something as well. So, sow the seed, if you will. So, um, thank you guys so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. This has been your girl, Des, with Des Crazy Life. Signing off. Bye, guys.